They're coming. What? Huh? What? what are you doing? Um, working. You're always working. Uh, that's really boring. Come on, it's Christmas. Come on, can't you take a break? Like, can't you come hang out and watch Midsummer with me like we do every Christmas? Um, yeah, I just gotta, I, I, I gotta do these things because I'm packed up. Um, because oh. all these Mandalorian reactions, like uh, everyone's like waiting on to get these done. I just gotta get these done first, and I can probably come just, on, hang come on. Well. Baby Grogu can wait. Let's 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 just celebrate. Come on, let's put on some party hats and and drink some eggnog and really get into the Christmas spirit. Come on, you can take a break. Um, what time is it? It's like um whenever. Uh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. I'll probably take a break then. Yay! Okay. We did it. Okay. Right. I'll take a break. Okay. What? Is he? Is he gonna? Is he dip? I think he actually just cut me off online. Um. Oh. You know, working too hard on Christmas is literally the worst thing that one possibly. Oh, yay! Yay! Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Yay. Yo, Kaiser, 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 we need to talk. We need to talk right now. Uh, I think I messed up. I messed up real bad, Kaiser. Uh, do you have a second? First of all, calm down, okay? What's going on? Uh, I just think, I think, you know, that thing we talked about, uh, it didn't go exactly uh, like planned. Wait, 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 wait. That thing or that other thing? Uh, um, well, I got two of them. So, like, both? What okay, do I do? Both All right, listen, listen, listen. We talked about this. Last resort, but we can always bring them over to the dungeon and have Piggy Smalls take care of them. Oh, great. Okay, let's just do that then. Let's, yeah. just, let's just do that. Whoa, wait, 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 wait. It's not going to work. Piggy Smalls is a vegetarian. Oh, okay. Uh, so so uh, what well, do I do? Let me think about this. Okay, plan B. I got plan B. Do you have a vat in your backyard? Preferably one the size of about a 170 pound man. Yes, of course. Of course I have a vat. Okay, good. Because if not, I can get you a vat by 2 p.m. Yeah, yeah, no, no, I, I got the vat. Okay, I, got, I, know, I got that. I know people in the vat business. Oh, look, I think someone's coming. You know what? Never mind. I, I, I think we just got to uh, pause this and we'll, we'll bring this up later, okay? Thanks. What the hell's going on? Oh, Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas! Hey, speaking of Christmas, Adam, you mind yeah. if I open your the stocking? Oh, please! Let's uh, we have a, a great gift exchange going on here. I can't wait oh. to, to see what I got you. Yeah, Adam filled my stocking with with wonderful uh, and enjoyable presents and prizes. The first one is it's a half and half creamer. Yes, <laughs> I know how you love it. I know how you love it. All right, what else do we have? Creatine. That's oh. handy. Adam, thanks so much, buddy. You get your rage uh, on. Get your rage I, on. What else do we have? I don't know why it's very, very funny, but how depressing this gift exchange is. <laughs> it's another it. half and half creamer. Yeah. Come on, Drew. You love <laughs> half and <laughs> half. That's twice the half and half. Oh, well, you're, 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 yeah. <gasps> the 100 Questions movie quiz game. Hey. That may come in handy at some point. Maybe. I mean, uh, you know, it's a, we're just the two of us are the kind of people that like movie trivia. I mean, Drew, do you like movie trivia? I hate it, but I really love imagining what Paul's shelves look like the rest of the year without the creatine and the creamer. All right, I'm about to reach into my stocking here, my Boba Fett stocking. What, Paul, what is this that you got? I me? got you some good stuff, buddy. You got wow. me a trivia book as well, the Jedi Master's Quiz Book. Wow, <laughs> this is going to be some deep questions. I, I wonder if anybody would ever be challenged by the questions in this. Jedi Master's quiz book. Can we get like one question? Can we get one question from this Jedi Master quiz book? Paul, sure, because this this will probably only help Adam in conversation. <laughs> what was the name of Chewbacca's home planet, Drew? Nope. All right. Well, is it Paul, nope? It is not nope. It is Kashyyyk oh. with three Y's, I think. I can see George Lucas spelling nope with four N's. But I, I just want to tell you, Paul, you really shouldn't have. You really shouldn't have. Oh, wait, wait, what's this? What's this? Sixth day on VHS? Oh, oh you man. shouldn't have. You actually shouldn't have. 
Is that any good? Should I should I watch that at any point? Should I? Drew, you should check the sixth. You should check the sixth day out. I bet the I bet you're really gonna enjoy this, and this information will come in really handy. Add this to the list next yeah, to Jackie Brown. It. Yeah. Hey, yeah, let's sing the everybody's fine carol. Deck the halls with boughs of holly. Everybody's, everybody's fine, 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 fine. Cross. John Carroll Lynch is probably in this movie. Everybody's la, la, fine. La, 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 fine, la. fine, fine, fine. Uh, <laughs> Twin Peaks is not as popular in 09 as it is when it reboots later on. <laughs> fine, but you might have predicted something. Everybody's fine, or fine, fine, fine. <laughs> Everybody's <laughs> fine. <laughs> fine, fine, fine. Oh, fine. Merry fine. Christmas. Hello, hello. I'm Alex Mack, part of the Cult Action Crew, and we are here to do some holiday debating for all things Schmo Down on Schmo Bates. On Schmo Bates, where we cover the biggest questions Schmo Down needs to have answered. And for our second question, we're going to be asking our competitors today, both Nerd Chronic and PJ Campbell, what Schmodown competitor do you want to come to your holiday party? I mean, look, it's got to be Drew, right? Drew Bigwini, that is. He's one of the most well-spoken critics in the entire industry. We love him. He'd be so much fun to talk to while you're having holiday dinner. Who doesn't want a Drew McWeeny around? Uh, yeah, I mean, I, I had the same thought. I was actually, I was thinking Drew, um, but particularly Drew Guy. Oh, I mean, wow. he's obviously okay. like the, the life of the party in and out mm -hmm. off the camera, you know, like he's always on the camera. He's just the fucking the, the best. Sorry. And then uh, I think he's, you know, he's the, definitely the one people want to have around. Two and one, Team McQueenie and Team mm. Guy. I'm here for both of them. And let's face it, we all want them at a Schmodown party, yeah. right? I mean, they're both national treasures. One significantly, obviously, more than the other. But I digress. Mm -hmm. We're going to be moving on to our final question of tonight's episode of Holiday Schmobates, which is, who is the biggest Grinch in Schmodown? Mm. Now, last time we started PJ, so we're going to be starting with Eric this time around. Mm. Go ahead. Uh, the biggest cringe. I'm trying to think of, you know, the people who, I mean, there's, there's a bunch of kayfabe that I think we can appreciate in the showdown. If like, you know, there totally. might be a Grinch on off the camera, but like a good person outside. But I think the person that we kind of like can agree that it's, it's like, it's like kind of unbearable to see on camera, but like also a little bit unbearable to be with off camera. It's like his uh, video drew, right? It's like, do we, uh, <sighs> I mean, uh, uh, the, to take the kayfabe a little bit like too much off the camera and like the times sometimes you need, you need a break. And I'm glad that kind of like we, we've had that, you know? I mean, I can't even argue with you you at all at this. I mean, I'm pretty sure she's actually hiding dead bodies somewhere with Tom. Like, and I don't think that's kayfabe at all. You know, like mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure that's real. I, I yeah. don't think I want that around my family. Yeah, we don't. I think yeah, we don't have enough evidence to move forward with that. But one day, I hope we do, because that way we can finally you know just do away with that. And two and one and time. That wraps up our final arguments for our third and final question here on tonight's episode of Holiday Schmo Bates. She's late again, and I haven't Love heard me. from her. Yeah, I, I haven't heard anything either. I got another mock match done instead of studying for a test, which I failed. I, why are you dragging me in in the middle of finals? Okay, here, let's just make it simple. We'll deal three categories in one shot. We'll just add it in on Friday night. That way we get two things done at once, and Drew cannot complain that we're not maximizing our time, for goodness sakes. Well, I mean, if you can catch her between watching Hamilton for the 157th time or doing a TikTok, I mean, it's probably why she's late. Probably. Yeah, I wish she would really appreciate our time and how much effort we're putting in. Yeah, I mean, my, my family's getting concerned. I mean, yeah. poor Trevor, I mean, his fans. I, I, I don't have much of a life, but I, I got stuff to do, you know, I... It's Thursday night. It's critical role. I should be watching that. And I, instead, I'm here waiting, waiting on her. Now you yeah, that hell, Jill. Adelia, don't you have a column to write instead of waiting around for her? Yeah, column to write. There's a quiz to mod. If she's late to that too, I might, I might scream. And why in God's name are we doing this at like midnight Eastern time? I know she wants us to delay it a little longer, but goodness sakes. It's because but I don't think she wakes up before there. noon. If we're well, not, we're back to go upstairs and hang out with my family. Yeah. My family's wondering where I am, too. 
Yeah, no, I've I've had to disappear from my family every night for the entire week to do these. Lucky. <laughs> I wish there was a little bit more appreciation for our time. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah, yeah she seems so nice on camera, but behind the scenes. Oh, We're here goodness. because we love her. Yeah. And we we love how she drills us to death on these questions and her questions. Is anybody oh. sure what a musical is anymore? No. <laughs> Didn't she miss that one question seven times in a row? Yes, rock. Yes, rock. So, uh, you know, I just, I don't know how much longer we can sort of crash here. So I just thought maybe Tiny Taco could stay for you, could stay with you maybe during the holidays. He's just, he's had some breathing problems lately and that would be great. Oh, oh no. Yeah. yeah, no, that's fine. Tiny Taco, I, you know, he's, he's cute. Like, sure. Why not, man? I, I can, I can help out for a little bit. Yeah. Cause they're, they're going to turn off my water and they're going to turn off the power oh, no. here soon. And they're going to turn Dude, off the, I think yeah. they already turned off the gas and uh, they're going to turn off the oxygen, oh. which I didn't even think was what? a thing you could turn off. Are you, is your apartment in space? Like, what do you, the yeah. oxygen? How do you do that? I don't, they've got, it's like gonna suck all of the, uh, I don't, it's something like Christopher Nolan designed it. I don't know how it works. Wow. They're also gonna okay. turn off right. the sun. So, like, I won't be able to see that what? anymore. I'm really behind, man. They're gonna I'm turn behind. off the sun. Are you, well, my, my first question, and then I have a follow up question. My first question right. is Are you on the Truman Show? Maybe. Um, my second question it. is, was, was Drew not willing to help you though? Like, why, why didn't you just uh, help Drew? Yeah, Drew, uh, Drew is great, but like, she doesn't believe in help. Uh, she doesn't believe in helping people. I think different. it's against, I think she said, I didn't even know she was religious, but I think she said it's against her religion. So it's against her. That seems like the polar opposite of every other religion. Yeah. Ever. Drew's like a good because friend, typically... as long as you don't yeah. ever need somebody to like rely on or who's like going to help you out or like be there for you or who's like a good that... person. But other than that stuff. I mean, that's the polar opposite of what a good friend is. But um, all right, man, look, it's fine. It's fine. I mean, you've seen my apartment. It's not super huge, so I'm not going to promise y'all hell of space. But, you know, what's mine is yours. I mean, he's Tacos a tiny a taco, so. He's a tiny yeah. taco. It's all good. Who doesn't love a tiny taco? You yeah. know what I mean? Like, I typically, I get drunk. I have at least four tiny tacos before bed. So it's totally Fair fine. Enough. Cool, man. You are looking live at the movie Trivia Schmodown. Hello, friends. Baby Carrots here. You thought we were done, didn't you? You thought, oh, we couldn't possibly cram any more matches into a stacked 2020. And what a Schmodown spectacular it was but we reached deep into our holiday stocking. We pulled out a special season of giving surprise. That's right. One more match, a triple threat featuring Santa Claus, Chris Kringle himself versus Mr. Eight Crazy Nights, Hanukkah, Harry taking on video drew Ooh, what a scintillating matchup this is going to be you have santa claus aka chris kringle he's been keeping a list and i'm pretty sure he's got harry and drew on the naughty side of things you have hanukkah harry perhaps the most magical beard even besting kurt russell as santa claus and then video drew what a conundrum what an enigma she is i don't know much about what is about to go down folks but i can promise you this it's going to be the toughest holiday three-way since eyes wide shut and now as always we go to a stellar video package promotion material done by our own nerd chronic eric take it away and i'm 
I'm sorry, folks. Just give, I know it's live. Give me one sec. I'm seeing in the private chat. There is an issue. I don't, (laughs) okay. It appears I'm being told video drew cannot participate in this matchup tonight because she's lost her holiday spirit. Well, I don't know where we go from here. This is a guy who knows how to rule on challenges. I I have the answer to every movie trivia question at my fingertips, yet I don't know how to resolve this. Folks, I'm at a loss for words, and I'm not the right person to usher you through the rest of this vid. Woo! Yeah! Yeah! Right! Oh, man! I can't can't believe it. Let me tell you something, boys. Let me tell you something. 2021 was our year. I mean, we won the faction championship. I couldn't be more proud of you guys. I mean, first of all, who'd have thought Smash, Spider, teaming up in teams, winning a championship? I, I think the Corn Flakes are going to do great things in 2022. I think you yeah. guys are monsters, and I'm just so glad that Smash really pushed you guys into teams and said, I mean, once IG was defunct, I mean, w- there was really nowhere for you guys to go anyways. They turned it in. IG became the... The David Lynch, what was it? The David Lynch category? The, was- the MCU category. Oh, it was the MCU category. Yeah. Which yeah. ghost? You won that. I can't even keep up. You're you're the you're the the new MCU champion. Yeah. Congratulations, yeah. Congrats, man. Thanks, Vinny, man. Vinny, yeah. you went from I think you were the first person announced during free for all the David mm-hmm. Lynch free for all the first yes. annual. Correct. You went through fifty eight competitors yeah. from the, from Amazing. number one. Was it even unbelievable? More? Didn't no. miss a single question. Watching no. Vinny, watching Vinny sort of come up like like this sort of demigod was was uh, not only it was, was it a point of pride for me. oil, unstoppable this season. Damn. Yeah, unstoppable. Nah, well, yeah. Zipper, you became a master woodworker and still managed to finish second in the in this in the te- was it teams the teams tournament. You finished second by himself. Yeah, yeah it was just and to was uh, to deal. take Damon to the wall and take him down. I mean, yeah, uh, right. I, I didn't see, you know, I was pretty confident, but even I didn't see that coming. But it has just been a hell of a year for the dungeon. And, you know, to go from last to first in so many categories, right. it's just it's just pretty magic. And I think for next year, we just really have to, to, to focus in on what it is that made us go from last to first. And I, I think, I guess the big difference here is, uh, oh, well, well, we don't have video Drew anymore. Oh. Yeah. 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 Right. Yeah. Right. So let's let's make sure to go into the next year with no Finally. video Drew. I hadn't even thought yeah. of that. That's funny. You know, it, video it, Drew. It is. Huh. No Ghost. video Drew. That's a key to our success. I mean, Ghost, what do you think? I mean, was that what you think Drew was pretty much the weakest link or pretty much the weakest link and honestly for a guy who calls himself Ghost? I've not seen a better disappearing act than Video Drew. Like, yeah, I mean, they, it was almost yeah. like there was a vaccine to her that we got along with our COVID vaccine. And back honestly, and better. Exactly. Maybe, good right. riddance, good riddance. We've been better this whole season without her. Yeah. I mean, think about I it. I wanted to do door to door caroling. She didn't want to do that. All you yeah. guys, written, I mean, why, why wouldn't? Who are, where are the guys? Another that, unanimous vote. Who heard of the, any of the songs she wanted to sing? Frankly, that was the problem there. I well, just, you know. Mm. Yeah. I didn't just didn't get it. Smash, would you like to lead us in a rendition of Come All Ye Faithful? Again? No, you already had me do that. I, I think uh, I just want to say that I'm, I'm proud of everybody here, and I, I'm, we're, we're very thankful for Video Drew not being on this team. Agreed. Yeah. Here, here. Agreed. We're, we're thankful for three things. We're thankful for the COVID vaccine, that Smets beat cancer, and that Video Drew is gone.